Hey guys, welcome back to WP Event Manager. In this video, we're gonna talk about a very simple topic and I get asked that a lot as well. How we can modify our WordPress website using custom CSS. So suppose uh, you have a theme that you liked for a reason and, and say you don't really like a single element of that theme as far you need. So let's take this search box over here for the example. It it's okay but not that appealing so we are trying to simulate this scenario we love this theme but we don't like this search box over here so with the help of bit of css if you know css how styling works you can easily fix it right so we're gonna show you how you can include custom css uh, in the wordpress website without worrying about losing those changes in later on when you update the theme so if you already didn't knew wordpress has a built-in default css editor and that applies the css globally on the wordpress website to access the css editor we're gonna click on customize and then we're gonna click on additional css so this will open up a css editor for us that we can now use to modify our website so firstly we're gonna click on inspect to inspect the element we are gonna edit right so by saying that i hope like you already know what we are talking about over here and you know how css works so you are pretty comfortable with editing css files to style your own company so we see the section over here uh, that we're gonna style we're gonna remove the border around uh, the whole section and apply it only on the search uh input over here right so let's copy the class and that we're gonna paste here we can remove the parent identifier and then we're gonna type in that border none and we're gonna say important so let's hide the border for our entire section so now we have a form and that says search form so what we're gonna do we're gonna type in widget search and narrow our search depth into the specific query and we're gonna say border uh, color as this solid and width should be one pixel or maybe two pixel okay that looks good and now as you can see we have uh, the border around the form but it looks pretty weird since our input has a black border right so what we can do we can inspect this element we can copy the search field and then we're gonna paste it over here before that we're gonna copy old parent selector as well right so now we can cover it on curly braces we're gonna type in border none and we're gonna we're gonna type important so now if we hover over here okay we still have the uh, border maybe it's not the border it's maybe the outline okay we can do that as well let's say outline none important let's see if it did anything yes that did the trick and you will see the input over here is very narrowly sticking to our left hand side how we can fix that let's say we type in margin left and five pixel so yeah that looks way better let me adjust it to 10 pixel okay beautiful and now you will see oddly the uh, button over here is showing right above the field we're gonna type in uh, position relative to see if that fixes anything for us at all so yeah no, uh, there it nicely appears over here but it's not really pretty at this moment what we can do we can type in absolute for our positioning rule and we can type in position relative for our parent so that's the form and now you will see the search bar over here appears perfectly as a beautiful elegant design so the point is over here not modifying the search uh, bar over here the point i'm trying to make is make if you have a theme that has a great layout great appearance that you like but certain elements that you don't like you can always like 
use the code inspector on the your browser and nitpick the elements you don't like and write a bit of custom CSS to make that appealing. So that's the example over here. I like this theme, but I don't like the search bar over here. So what I did, I opened up the customizer and selected few uh, elements and write like total 15 line of codes over here to make it appealing. So it's like why giving up on a whole theme when you can fix a little element to make it perfect. I hope this video gave you a little bit idea and a boost to modify your themes as per your needs. Come join me in our next video. I'm not sure what I'm gonna talk about, but until then, I'm Sharad saying goodbye. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.